Hey, it's Hank Chen. You're watching Celeb Secrets TV. I am so excited to be part of Life Size 2. I was drawn to this role because, like most of you guys out there, I'm an OG fan. The original came out in 2000 with Tyra Banks and Lindsay Lohan. Lindsay has a special little, uh, I can't say much more. This version of Life Size 2 is such an upgrade from the original one because the original was a Disney movie and this is still Disney but it's freeform. Tyra who's the executive producer and the star knows that people like myself OG fans grew up watching her in this film and we're older now. Young adults with lives and bills and disastrous love lives and responsibilities that we didn't have when we were 10 years old and we need people on TV that we can relate to and so Francia Raisa plays a, uh, a CEO of the toy company that makes the iconic Eve doll. And she is 25 years old and going through a quarter life crisis. And I play her best friend, a character named Brendan Butler, and I also happen to work for her. So that can always be a little complicated when you're working for your friends. And so you'll see some interesting dynamics in that relationship. And I just do my best to be a friend put her in her place when she needs to be, give love, receive love, uh, and it's just a really fun time. I know that the original fans are gonna be really, really happy when they see how we upgraded. What is gonna resonate most with fans is Tyra Banks. She is an icon, this whole movie is iconic. Life Size, you have the original in 2000, it's a Disney movie, Lindsay Lohan, who is a pop culture icon herself. People wanna know what happened to Casey Stewart. We're gonna give you some answers, but also, most importantly, Tyra Banks is number one on the call sheet. She's executive producer. She had a hand in everything, including hiring me. Thank you. And her vision is just so strong and so clear, and you're gonna to wanna to see what she does with this movie, because Eve is like so familiar, but different, but like more and extra. I mean, Tyra doesn't call her Eve 2.0 for nothing, so you'll have to tune in to find out exactly what that means. I had so many fun memories when I was on set. A lot of the best memories happened when we were off set. Our cast became pretty tight, and we would often celebrate, actually when we were there, there were several birthdays, including our director, Steven Sushita, his birthday was there. And then we celebrated Alison Fernandez, who honestly, I was like, this little girl has the biggest resume out of all of us. She's been on like a series regular on like two shows, she's recurring on this show, she's in this movie, she was in Logan, Wolverine. The, I, was, I was like, Aren't you like seven? Like, why do you have the resume of, a, of an 80-year-old Oscar winner? What is this? But she had a birthday there, and we all went and played mini golf. And it was, I felt like a kid again. And that, I think that's what this movie's all about. You, it's Christmas, it's nostalgic, it's warm, it's fuzzy. And it's supposed to wrap you in a nice, fuzzy blanket and just give you a hug. And so there were so many of those experiences that really replicated and emulated what we're trying to deliver audiences. There are so many things that I want audiences to look out for when they watch this. We have so many Easter eggs, that's what they're called, right? They're called Easter eggs to the first film. So I encourage you, when you're about to sit down for Life Size 2, to re-watch the original Life Size. I think it's broken up into like seven, 10 minute chunks on YouTube. Just watch it and then watch our movie and it's gonna be that much more gratifying. It's like a good improv show where they do a callback. You're like, hey, hey, they talked about Overeaters Anonymous 10 minutes ago. Or, oh, look, they mentioned the pink dress again. <laughs> it's fun. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Tune into Life Size 2 this December on Freeform, 25 Days of Christmas.